1106. I am headed to my meeting. I have nine minutes to get there, so I think I'll make it. It should only take three or four to get to school, and then I have to walk down to the room, so it's no big deal. Um, but I'm actually pretty excited for today. I was just thinking about, I don't know, I wanted to say like thank you to my history teacher for always just being there. And I was gonna, and I was like, that's really cheesy. Like, he doesn't need to have, like, like, yeah, obviously thank you was nice, but I honestly, sometimes I question if I thank him too much, um, like, for every little thing. And then he's always like, I'm just the mist, I'm just the mist. And I'm like, or, you know, I'm missing the wind. And I'm like, I realize that. But to me, the wind that you were in, <laughs> like, blew me in a completely different direction. I just want to say thanks and appreciate the mist, I guess. I don't know. Um, Anyway, so I kind of want to say thank you to him, but at the same time it's like I don't want to bother him with too many things. I don't know. Um, but I'm in a really good mood and I was going to be like, hey, just so you know, I know that I thank you a lot. Sometimes it might be a little too much or I don't really know, but I'm in a good mood. This is how one of the ways I express my happiness, so thank you. Bye. <laughs> Alright, well I'll talk to you guys later. I have to get to school in a meeting. Ah, bye. It is sometime 320 something. People said amen. Oh, <laughs> not what I expected. People said amen. Oh, <laughs> it's three. Okay, it is 3:22. Um, I know you guys don't always have the best angle when I set the camera there, but just a second while I put my seatbelt on. Um, I'm going to head home. Actually, no, what I'm talking about. I'm going to my grandma's. I just feel like going to my grandma's today, so I'm gonna go there and then um, go home later. So. Hopefully my grandma has good food to eat. I'm really hungry, so I'm going to go there and eat, then go home. I have tons of homework. Ugh. It's the weekend, though. Woo! All right, bye. I'm at my grandma's house. It is 5.08, and I backed out from, like, up near her house, and I went to leave, and I look in the window because she's always standing there waving, and that's going to be someday I'm going to miss that so, so much. I'm just going to think of that and probably cry. Um... Because right now I'm just like choked up. I'm like, Grandma, don't do this to me. <laughs> but at the same time, I love you so much. Go for it. Um, but yeah, so anyway, I look. And she's holding up these newspapers. So I pull up to the house. And <laughs> she's like, you don't want these? And I'm, or you forgot these? And I'm like, I don't want them. And she's like, oh, okay, bye. <laughs> and I'm just like, Grandma, you're crazy. Um, I love my grandma so much. She's like my mom, but not. <laughs> um, but yeah, she's... She's like my second mom, but I consider her just, she's so, so near and dear to me. I I can share more, way more with her than I can with my actual mom, and it's just, that's why calling her my second mom seems wrong, um, but she is, because she's like the first mom for me, and although she's technically my grandma, so it's like she's my super close grandma lady, woman, person, I don't know. I'm going to miss her a lot someday and her cooking oh my goodness <laughs> I had um it's like a chicken salad sandwich or turkey you know or not turkey tuna salad but it's with beef it's so good and um and then I had a salad with apples and cashews and stuff in it and it was amazing so I mean she she feeds me so well and she just teaches me mostly pretty well um morally some things she does aren't the best just not morally it's nothing extreme like she's a, an amazing amazing woman but it's just you know like with my beliefs as a Christian it's like instead of holding a grudge let it go type thing like I don't know that's the kind of thing I'm talking about okay I've been rambling for too long so I was just trying to get my bag um actually you out of my bag my purse and I went hang on I accidentally honked the horn of my car um so anyway let me grab my backpack and put it on. My dad, as I was just trying to get my stuff out of the car and head inside, he called about dinner and um, we're having chicken strips and french fries so I'm going to grab that on the way in and like we have a freezer out in our garage so I have to grab it from there. Um, but anyway, so do you guys want to come inside with me? You can stay out here if you want. I'll just take the memory card or the camera can stay out here. You guys can stay out here with it. Um, or you can come in with me. You want to come inside? Oh, okay. Let's go.